take control of your flipping life 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 I'm big with it I don't know how to do the dance good. I don't know how to baby. Anyway, yo, um, America, what up? MOG, take control of your flipping life. Before we get started, shouts out to the brand, baby. Population Dynamo doing it big. I'm rocking the Black Diamond Collection, three quarter sleeve raglan tee. Gotta represent, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Um, man, the Black Diamond Collection is my favorite. Um, I love it. It's dope. And this color's fresh, but we got the black ones with the silver. Ooh! Girl, it's just crazy. You need a cop one. One for 30, two for 50. That's the summer special. Cop one. PLDM.storeenvy.com. Let me tell you another thing. It's kind of crazy. Michigan. Um, I would be uh, wearing a tank top or a t-shirt right now. Michigan's crazy behind. Uh, wants to be 51 degrees this morning. It's supposed to be summer right now, but Michigan wants to do what it wants to do. So it's like, no, I'm going to be cold. I'm going to be 50 degrees in July. You know what Michigan is like? It's like when you, next time you pass by an elementary school, I want you to do something. I want you to look out at all the kids and there's gonna be a class there and there's gonna be some poor little teacher and everybody in the class is gonna be behaving and in line and there's gonna be one little kid who's off running doing whatever the heck he wants to do and just causing a ruckus. That's Michigan. That little kid, that's Michigan. And you're gonna see it. Next time you pass by school, do it. I promise you, that's how it's gonna be. Anyhow, Population Dynamo. Uh, PLDM.storeenvy.com <laughs> Also, shouts out to DJ Stone, man. He did all the music on our uh, Failure Friday video. Shouts out to y'all, man. Showing love on the Failure Friday, man. We got a lot of views, a lot of comments. People are excited about it. And they're like, keep it coming, keep it coming. So we will keep it coming. So I was thinking, man, we have a, a movie montage mentality that's killing us. And, um... And so, man, I want to talk about the movie montage mentality with a few help from some of my favorite movie montages. Um, so let's go through these together, shall we? First is one of my favorites, Lion King. So you got Timon and Pumbaa taking Simba under their wing. And look, he's just growing up right before our eyes. Right before our oh, he's a grown man, just like that. What? He's a grown man in about five seconds. He's a grown man. That's it. No, no uh, getting sick. No having a fight for food. No arguments between him and Timon and Pumbaa. Just, I'm a grown man. That's it. And it's like, <laughs> life isn't like that, man. We gotta work for the things we want. We gotta grind for it. Man, it's like, that's how we do as believers, man. God promises something, and we just have this, man, movie montage mentality, like it's gonna come now, um, you know, after five seconds. But we gotta grind for it. Here goes the next one, Mulan. So, here we see Mulan. Oh, she's struggling to get up the pole. Um, the dude shot an arrow up there, and nobody could get it. And then all of a sudden, she's inspiring everybody. And everybody's like, you can do it, Mulan, except they don't know her name is Mulan. Her name is Poe. Um, anyway, he gets the, she got the arrow, threw it down. Now look at everybody. They were raggedy. Now all of a sudden, everybody's, you know, hitting the arrow, hitting the target, knocking cats out, you know, running all fast, jumping on poles and whatnot. You know what I'm saying? Then all in unison, dodging arrows, breaking stuff with the head. Catch a fish with their bare hands. You know, it's like, it's, <laughs> yeah, what about all the work? What about getting to that point? Um, yo, movie montage mentality for real. Man, last one. The king of the montages. My favorite, 
favorite. I want to do Rocky 1, but I ended up doing Rocky 3, Clever Lane. By the way, a little side story. My wife one time, she had never seen Rocky. She didn't watch Rocky until a few months ago. I put her on. And then all of a sudden, like two days later, she watched like all five. She went crazy Netflix binging on all the Rockies. I love my wife. Alright, so your boy, Rocky, messing up. Starting his, his training with Apollo, Mickey had died, can't hit the ball, he don't know how to step right. Apollo, you know, he black, he smooth, so he got to step, step, and then, you know, he's getting whooped, running, he's bumping into Apollo, ain't getting it, you know, uh, Adrian still likes him, you know, plus, look, man, so that's a slow grip, boy, but that took time, it wasn't no quick thing, alright, you know, he, he ain't really hitting the ball, He's trying, trying. Even uh, 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 even uh, Paulie's helping out. So then, this is showing you his progress. He was getting whooped in the run. All of a sudden, you know, he's getting with Apollo. You know, he got to step right, step, step, step. And then, uh, you know, he's getting okay. Maybe he might be even beat Apollo. We gonna see. You know, learning, learning, learning. Uh, 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 left, right, 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 right. Now I'm gonna do a little faster, right, right, right. <laughs> then they show the progress, progress. You know, all of a sudden, he's killing the game. You know, Adrian likes it. And then all of a sudden, he's beating Apollo in a run. My thing is, you see that he was training, but that training takes place in a matter of about 40 seconds and it's done and all of a sudden he's the man um it's not how it works in life and the movie montage mentality it could really sneak into the church too man we think that things are just gonna come without hard work you know people are gonna hear the message and we don't have to love on them and we don't have to you know pick people up for church like old basic stuff we don't have to share the gospel man shoot invite people out to lunch coffee and share the gospel with them like it's going to take work. It takes work. Uh, if you want to build a business, man, it takes work. I'm, I'm doing that, you know, and, and it takes work. And so, man, it's not like a montage where, you know, shows you this long passage of time and effort and it's like shrunk into 35 seconds. You got a business and you're starting. You got an idea. Uh, you want to and launch a musical career, something like that. It's gonna take work, man. It's not a movie montage. You're gonna have to work and rely on God, trust in Him and everything that He said to you, and, and, and go for it, go for it. It's not gonna be 35 seconds of uh, 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 a company with some music, though. It's gonna be a lot of hard work, maybe some tears in there, and you just gotta keep grinding, man, know what God said about you. Yeah, man. Take control of your flipping life.